Hello friends, welcome to JavaFX uh, 2D tutorials. In this video, we are going to see how to draw arcs. When we discuss about drawing arcs, we will discuss about normal, rounded and chart type of arcs. Here, if you see, we are drawing four type of arcs. All these arcs are based on circles. So, you can also draw arcs based on ellipse. Here, if you see, this is circle right and in circle x and so if this is the center, this will be x and this will be y and x and y radius are same but if you change x and y radius you will be getting ellipse then when you start drawing arc you will be seeing different arc here x and y radius are same same distance right so if it is a ellipse then say for example let's state this is a x radius y radius and if you draw an arc it will be something like this So, to draw arc, we need to construct a node of type ARC arc. Then, we are setting the center of arc, just like how we set center for circle. The same way, we are setting a center for the arc. After that, we are setting X radius and Y radius. Then, we specify start angle as 0 and end angle as 90. So, these are all the parameters for drawing an arc. After that, we set the standard attribute. Like here, if you see, we are setting set fill as null. That means uh, we are not uh, drawing any filled shape. We are just uh, drawing the outline of the arc. And stroke color here, we are setting it as uh, light yellow at runtime we will change this color based on the background so if it is white background yellow won't uh, do good so we will change that then stroke width here i am using it as a four that's the stroke width means you can imagine that as a pen thickness so if you see here center this will be the center for the arc so this center is 100 comma 250 then radius this is the radius radius x is 50 and radius y is 50 after that start angle is 0 and we are asking to draw the arc till 90 degree so this is 90 degree that means so based on this we are drawing the arc here you are seeing how we drawn the arc now let us look at the variance here set length is 90 right now let me set this length as 180 and if you see the angle is 180 now or we can say this is 0 90 180 270 means you will be getting like this this is 360 complete circle if you change this x and y axis then you will be getting arc based on the ellipse so arc type so this is a normal arc and if you set arc type as a chart start and end point will get joined here if you see if i join it like this this is my arc here if i join start and end point I'll be getting arc like this so useful to perform a arc with a closed enclosed region so this is chart type next comes arc type round so using the set type method you can set uh, type of the arc so here 
you are seeing chart type arc and here it is a round type arc round type means start and end point will go through the center so if you see here start point end point and it meets at the center so this is the shape you will be getting all right now let's go to the demo so here is our uh, previous uh, example remove unused imports now let me copy this file and uh, do a refactor so the example number is a uh, six and uh, we will call it as uh, drawing arcs so we will remove this piece of code so now we will now we will draw the arcs so in the example we shown you only one piece of uh, code so here we actually drawn four arcs we will import the shape from uh, java fx scene and if you see all parameters are same we will be changing the x and y location here x is 100 y is at 250 then we are changing the center location of the arc and all other parameters are same except the end start angle 0 set length 90 so 90 means here we are setting the length of the arc in terms of degree radius i mean uh, the end angle radius so first time we are using the length as 90 degree next we specify it with 180 then 270 finally 360 so we are already having root node right root node and if we removed the piece of code that gets the children so we will add that again and this time we will add all our four arcs to the group So from root we are getting the children, we call that as shapes, then we are adding all our four arcs to this uh, group node and it is part of the scene and scene is part of our uh, primary stage. Alright, now we will rebuild this uh, project. Now we will run drawing arcs. So if you see here, we generated the arc based on start and end angle. You can experiment changing this radius, I mean setting a different radius, x and y radius. okay before adding our arc to to the shape or to the scene graph we will set the arc type so here we are making use of arc type dot chart constant we will export the we will import the required class arc type we will run this file again so 
chart means you can see how it is a joining start and end point now uh, instead of chart let's use uh, round Now if we see start and end point, both are joined through the center point of the arc. So here this is the center point, here it is a center point, x and y radius are same. This is a start angle 0, 90, 180, 270 and when we go to 360, we will be seeing a complete uh, circle. Just now you saw the demo. Thank you for watching. Bye.